Oh, good morning, YouTubers. Anybody who's ever had a mouse in their in their kitchen or in their house knows how much a pest they can be. However, they're nothing compared to little critters like a vole or a shrew. So what you do is you find their holes, like so. This is a little apple tree outside the back window. And you can see I've got a trap here. And what this consists of is just basic mouse trap. Drill a hole in the back side of it where the where the trigger is and put a 10 penny nail in and stick it right in the ground and the trap won't go anywhere and then you put a cover on some in this case I use a Pepsi bottle, half a Pepsi bottle and cut it in half and then put a piece of wire holding it in because we had a little critter get in the house and you could tell it wasn't a wasn't a field mouse, it was avoiding mouse traps which voles will tend to do, they run a straight trail and in this case it wasn't uh, it was not only just a vole but appearances of it appears to be a shrew and he's getting the house they're, they can be nasty but they're very hard to trap with a traditional mouse trap I'll try to focus this in there you go and they can be hard to trap with a traditional mouse trap because they usually won't take the bait and this one didn't so I finally put a trap out right by its hole and this is what I ended up with so I reset the trap and it's been set for quite a while now I've got nothing else so I think I might have got the only one because it came right in over that front of that trap and you could actually see it bobbing up and down outside the hole and here's the customer so if you see any uh, vole scat and you can tell because it's green it'll be greenish brown it, and it'll be wet it won't be hard like a mouse look outside and you can tend to find their tracks we actually found the tracks the other day the hole right here leading right up to the side of the house right where he was coming in so and we haven't had any problems since so that's a cheap and effective little trap you can do yourself. You don't have to call an exterminator, save you a few dollars. Between the mouse trap and that, uh, and that Pepsi bottle, investment of two, $2. And don't put any bait on the trap. No bait at all. It doesn't need it. There's no bait on that trap. Just put it right between their holes like that. And you can see it's right. There's one hole in front of it and one hole on the other end of the base of that tree. And there's a hole right there. Eventually they'll stick their head in there and that's exactly what happened. So there you go, folks. Cheap and easy way to make yourself a trap for voles and shrews and, and uh, any other little critters you can have that come in your house. Save yourself some money and don't have to call on the uh, uh, exterminator. Have a good day, YouTube.